To change the price of a product in Shortcuts, you can go directly to the Products window under Inventory, select a company, select a line, and then adjust the price on specific products. Now in this case, you may adjust the buy price or the sell price manually by selecting that number in its particular column. However, let's say you had an updated price list for an entire line. So every item in my volume line, I need to adjust both the buy and the sell price. Rather than going one item at a time, I can select the line at volume. And if I right click on my mouse, I have a pop-up window that appears and that allows me to adjust what all of my buy prices or my sell prices are for this particular item or these items, I should say. So I will right click and I will change my sell price. Shortcuts gives you a number of different features. So in this case, if this year all of my products go up 5% for this line, I can just type in five and that is a percentage increase. Or if I need to go up by a fixed dollar amount, in this case, all of my volume items need to go up by $1. I can then enter in the amount and press done. And shortcuts will add $1 to all of the products within that line. If I needed to update my buy price, again, I can right click and change my buy price. So both my sell price and my buy price for a particular line can be selected. If everything under a particular company, under Goldwell, for example, everything had gone up 50 cents or $1, then again, I can right click on the entire company and tell shortcuts, I need to adjust my sell price for all of these items, whether it's going up by a percentage or a fixed dollar amount, I have those options.